You're watching KS3 News Explainer. In this video, we are going to talk about wet leasing of aircraft. This is for GS Paper 3, Economy. The Civil Aviation Ministry has allowed Indian Airlines to take wide-body planes on wet lease for up to one year as it pursues efforts to make the country a key international hub for air traffic. The rules were relaxed, allowing airlines to wet lease wide-body planes for a year based on specific requests as opposed to the six months currently. Now, what is wet leasing? According to OAG Aviation, the technical term for wet leasing is ACMI, which stands for Aircraft Crew Maintenance and Insurance. This means the airline leasing the plane from another carrier gets not just the vehicle, but also its crew, maintenance staff and insurance, but has to cover operating costs, such as fuel and airport fees, on its own. On the other hand, dry leasing means that the airline leases only the vehicle and uses its own staff to run and maintain it. There is also a middle ground called damp leasing, wherein the airline wet leases a plane but uses its own cabin crew. Now, why do airlines wet lease? Airlines rely on wet leasing when they want to ensure smooth operations during peak times to deal with delays or as a means of testing new routes. Wet lease aircraft also serve as a means of reducing service disruption in the event of uh, unforeseen situations such as lack of available crew or technical faults and to counter potential surges in airfares. Wet leasing allows them to avoid massive lump sum payments that upfront purchases involve. That's it for this explainer. Thank you so much for watching. To join KS Trainer courses and to crack the IS exam, visit kstrainer.com. You can also get a PDF of this explainer on kstrainer.com. Thanks for watching and do subscribe to our channel.